Well, welcome back everybody. Temperatures remain into the 70s this evening as the showers continue to move in across South Mississippi. You can see the raindrops behind me out here at our sky cam. Midtown Hattiesburg from the Mississippi Power Camera Network at USM 77 right now. And it's a wet evening, not only in Hattiesburg, but also out in the pedal too. As we overlook the Evelyn Gandy Parkway, they're sitting at 79 degrees and you can see the headlights are on on everybody's car. Even a couple of raindrops on the camera lens this evening. We do have the rain beginning to move back into Hattiesburg this evening. Here's what's happening at right now at the moment out towards Waynesboro. We're starting to see some lighter rain. This was the heaviest rain around five o'clock. Now into Hattiesburg out towards Paddle. You can start to see this second band begin to move back into the area. Richburg out towards Bobby Chain Airport and this continues to move from the south to north. Nice little shower out to the west of uh, the Moselle area kind of between Moselle and Seminary. More light to moderate rain around Collins and down uh, Highway 44 uh, down towards Columbia and Foxworth this evening and all this continues to move from the south and west to the north and east and we're going to see more of this activity continue through the next couple of hours but I think things will begin to come, uh, calm down and we'll see all the showers dissipate by about midnight tonight. We'll stay dry during the morning hours. If you want to do anything outside, I would recommend doing it before lunchtime uh, because after lunchtime, that's when we're going to start to see our rain chances go up and they'll make it up to about a 40% chance of rain during the afternoon and early evening hours. But uh, unlike the past couple of days, the rain chances are a little bit lower tomorrow because we're not expecting to see as grand of coverage across the region. Let me share what I'm talking about here with Futurecast. 70s during the morning, no problems during the early part of the day. This is why I say if you're going to do any yard work do it before lunchtime because the afternoon that's where we start to see these pop-up showers and thunderstorms and you notice the coverage a little less uh, widespread for your day on Saturday and this is also going to be the trend as we head into your Sunday as well so we'll keep the rain chances at 40 percent for both days Sunday will be a little warmer we'll make it up to 92 degrees and eventually we're going to start to see our rain chances come down but as those rain chances go down look at what happens to our temperatures they go up from 89 tomorrow to 93 Monday to 95 on Wednesday, and we're not stopping there. In fact, as we look at the seven day forecast, you're going to notice we'll eventually hit 96 by next Thursday and into next Friday. So the heat, unfortunately, is going to come back. And unfortunately as well, we're going to see that humidity stick around. So it's definitely going to feel much hotter with the heat index. All right, Patrick, thanks. Southern